Now, isn't this better than jumping around and cracking all the ice? What? <laughs> Do I look like a ball here? Put me down. Uh-oh. I forgot to say gently. A very big mystery. Nom, nom, nom! Nom, nom! Nom, nom, nom! <laughs> Somebody sounds hungry. <laughs> My novel berries. Ooh! I got it! I got it! Oh, I got it! True, I found one. Thanks, Bartleby. Found another pie pan, Your Highness. Oh, that's great news. It means more Nummelberry pies for Yeti Spring. Yeti Spring? Yes, the Yetis will be waking up from their winter sleep. They'll be very hungry, and they love Nummelberries. Can't get bought off. Head. There, finally. No. Oh. Another pie crust is ready. Special delivery, Nummelberries. Bartleby, can you please go get the Nummelberries? <laughs> Berries? <laughs> right away, Your Highness. <laughs> right away, Your Highness. <laughs> Thank you. The Nummelberries are here! And now they're not! The basket is empty. Bum, bum, bum. Empty? I don't get it. The basket was full, and then all of a sudden, poof, it was empty. Ooh, look at that. Oh, well, at least there's one little berry left. Hi there, little berry. Oh, you smell good. Delicious. <laughs> Petrifying purple. Someone has taken my nummel berries. We have a mystery on our hands. Don't worry, Rainbow King. We'll find your missing berries. We'll track them down because Detective True and Detective Bartleby are on the case. We are? Oh, yeah! I mean, we are. Splendid! Best of luck, detectives. Detectives, that's us. Detectives. Yeah. True, what are detectives? They solve mysteries by finding clues and following them. We just need to find our first clue. Clue! <laughs> hmm, what's this? Let me see. <gasps> no more berry juice. Our first clue. A big wet clue, too, don't you think? Those are footprints, B. Hmm. Whoever took the Nummel berries must have dropped some and then stepped on them. Leaving giant berry footprints when they ran away. We've solved the mystery. This is great. Can I have the first Nummel berry handful? Not quite, B. Because where are the berries? I. Oh, oh yeah. Let's keep following the footprints. Prince true. Well, then we better split up and look for more clues. <gasps> Another clue! A purple puddle! That could be from Nummelberries. Oh, <laughs> just a nice pop puddle. Uh-huh, okay. And uh, when was the last time you ate a Nummelberry, hmm? Admit oh. it. You love Nummelberries, <laughs> don't you? Don't you? <laughs> Uh, why are you shouting? Am I? Sorry. Okay. The buses might be able to answer you if you don't shout. <gasps> Look! More berry footprints! Wow! I am great at this detective stuff. Hi there! 
Did you see the passenger who left those berry footprints? No, I can't see who gets on. I keep my eyes on the road. But I did hear some big squishy footsteps on my last trip. A clue! Do you remember anything else? Um... Oh, that passenger kept saying, Yum, yum, yum! Another clue. clue. Could you please take us where that passenger went? Sure, I'm going that way now. Hop on! Baskets. I love baskets. Look, I'm in one. Oh, now I'm in another one. And this one's better. Ooh, is this one better? Or is this one better than this one? Look, a clue. A numbleberry. Do you think these baskets were full of them? Well, they were, but then they weren't. We were supposed to deliver them, but the berries just disappeared. So now we have to send them back up to Bunch of Munchum Island. Bartleby, I wonder if the berry bandit emptied these baskets. Is this, could this be? Another, Another clue? clue? Dun, 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 dun. If you don't mind, we'll catch a ride up with this empty basket. Sure thing. Bye, True. And Bartleby. Um, how are we gonna get back up there? I, oh yeah. Whoa! Whoa. Munchum Munch Munch Island. Island! Look at that! No! Not again! What's wrong, Farmer Mossa? True! The Nummelberries, they're gone! I just came back from Berry Island, and our whole crop just poof disappeared! <laughs> the whole crop? Well, almost all of it. There's one more basket left. Oh, not again! No! They really are all gone. What are the Yetis going to eat now? They're going to eat Nummelberry Pies. Because we're detectives and we're going to find them. Psst. True. We're all out of clues. We're a little clueless. Hmm. Then we better get some wish help so we can catch the Berry Bandit. Cue! Jimmy to the wishing tree, please. What are you doing, Z? I'm searching for Hide Z, a camouflage wish. It blends in anywhere so you can't see it. Now, I can't see it. We'll help you look for it. <laughs> Drew, where did you go? <laughs> that was fun, Hidesy. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, True. So what brings you here today? A berry bandit. All the berries in the kingdom are gone. And it's Yeti Spring. What? That's awful. It is. So Bartleby and I are detectives following the clues. Like squishy berry juice footprints. We're trying to find the berry bandit, but we ran out of clues. Come, sit. Let's have a think. <gasps> How do detectives usually find clues? Well, they look, listen, and sniff. <laughs> oh, Bartleby, I need a wish that will help me hear better and one that will help me smell better. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Magic! 
What a fun group of wishes. <laughs> Let's see what the Wishopedia says about their powers. Your first wish ah, is Snorful. It can sniff out smells that are barely even smelly. Hi, <laughs> <I> Snorful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Snorful can sniff out some new clues for us. Whoa! <laughs> Hiria is a hearing wish. It can pick up sounds from really far away and amplify them back to you. Maybe we can hear the sounds the Berry Bandit makes and follow them to find him. <laughs> and your third wish is... Grozer. It can make any plant you find in nature grow larger. Great! <laughs> what? Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Go get some clues and catch that berry bandit. Back to Bunja Muncha Mile and Cumulo! Wishes glow? You stubbed your toe? <laughs> no, I said thanks, Cumulo. It's loud here, isn't it? Let's see if Heria can hear any clues over all this noise. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose blue. Wake up, Heria. Wish come true. Hear anything, Heria? <laughs> I love saying that. <laughs> Oh. Try another sound. Oh. Not this time. <laughs> We're still not hearing any sound clues. Can you try again? Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> that's it, that's it. Yum, yum, yum. That's the eating sound we heard. Here we are. Let's go find oh. that sound. You go that way, I'll go this way. I'm going that way. I mean this way. Whoa! 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 I can hear you, Berry Bandit. <laughs> A Yeti after him. Wow, this place is amazing. Hey, True, can I have my next birthday party here? <laughs> <laughs> Bartleby, are you chasing or playing? <laughs> Oh. Here he has picked up a sound clue. Let's go. Which way did the berry bandit go? Uh, oh, you don't hear it at all now? Uh, they stopped making noises. Uh, Thanks for all your help, Hiria. <laughs> <laughs> A basket! Whee! Wait up, Bartleby! Aren't empty baskets great, True? B, that's it. The basket is empty because the berry bandit ate all the berries. That's why Hiria couldn't hear it anymore. And 
And if this basket was on the conveyor belt, that must mean the Berry Bandit has gone back down to... Whoa! The ground? Wow! See? I am a good detective. <laughs> I told you. I told everybody. Look! The Berry Footprints again! Let's follow, follow those, those footprints. footprints. Footprint? 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 Footprint. Aw, no more footprints. Detectives never give up. We look, listen, and sniff. We sniff clues out, too. <laughs> okay, so I'm not a dog with a great sniffer. Thankfully, I'm a cat with great looks. You're welcome. <laughs> Did you smell anything? Actually, I do smell a faint scent of Nummelberry. But it's not quite smelly enough for me to tell which way the smell went. We have a wish that can help us with that. Snorful, get ready. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Snorful. <laughs> wish come true. <laughs> that tickles. Snorful, can you sniffle the sniffs from this berry and then follow that smell? Wow, Snorful is a super sniffler. Ah -ha! The berry bandit caught you berry handed. So where are the rest of the berries? And why did you take them from everyone? Uh, Bartleby. True, please. I'm questioning our suspect in a non-shouty way, I might add. This isn't the berry bandit. Look at the size of its feet. They're way smaller than the ones we saw before. But it, 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 it's eating berries. This little cutie probably just found some spilled berries and stopped to eat them. Cutesy, cute, cuteness. Okay, it didn't steal the berries, but it probably saw who did. You're right. Did you see a berry-eating creature with big feet come this way? Or that way? <laughs> um, could you maybe just point to where it went? <laughs> Thanks. Snorkel, can you sniffle any berry smell that way? <laughs> and we're back on the clue trail. Enjoy your berry, cutie. Huh. Did we take a wrong turn instead of a right turn or a left turn? We must have. All that's here is a big wall of rock. <laughs> Meow. <laughs> There's that sound again. Yetis? <laughs> lots of yetis. Eating lots of nummel berries. Now we found our berry bandits. What are we gonna do, Drew? Ahem. Excuse me, yetis, but those berries, well, they don't all belong to you. Yeah, maybe we should go. Uh oh. Nom, nom, nom. I'm a ninja cat, not a numbleberry. Taking things without asking isn't good. The Rainbow King and Farmer Monster are pretty upset about the missing berries. <laughs> Rainbow King. <laughs> Miss Rainbow King. <laughs> You miss the Rainbow King. You speak Yeti-ish? Oh, that's the craziest thing I've ever heard. I do speak a little Yeti-ish. <laughs> Hello, uh, did I mention that I'm a ninja cat? I am not a baby Yeti. Thank you very much. Put me to... Oh, boy. Rainbow King, come in. Are you there? True. I'm so happy to hear from you. Did you find my numbleberries? Yes. But I think you should come to the Yeti's cave right away. I'm on my way. Thank you. Oh, my Yeti friends must have woken up early. So early that your Nummelberry pies weren't ready for them yet. And without those pies, the poor things must have been so hungry. Well done, Detectives True and Bartleby. You solved the mystery. 
Yeah, no, they feel bad. Yeah, they feel bad about eating all the berries in the kingdom. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and me too. I feel bad too. Don't worry, my big furry friends. We understand now. Thank you. But what if the Yetis wake up early next spring? What if there aren't any pies or nummel berries? Won't they sneak around and take them again? Sapphire blue. True, that is a problem. Any ideas? I have one. A big one. Uh, uh, Mama Yeti, baby needs his berries. Yetis, you're going to go from berry eaters to berry farmers. We're going to teach you how to grow your own nummel berries. <laughs> oh, that's a great idea. <laughs> Oh. Ah. This could take a while. Time to use my last wish. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Rosen. Wish come true. Grozer, let's turn that sprout into a bush. A bush with nummel berries. Grow some more bushes, and you'll always have nummel berries ready for Yeti Spring. And what's better than nummel berries? Nummel berry pie! Hey. <laughs> Great job, Rainbow King. You know there's six of us, right? <laughs> <laughs> Are you hungry again, Bertleby? Oh. <laughs> Rainbow Rescue. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, whoa! Whoa! Yeah. Hi, Mom! Woohoo! Never ending Rainbow Day has started! I wish it really was never ending! Could you imagine a full time Rainbow Carnival? <laughs> I think it means the rainbow is never ending, Bartleby, not the day. Hmm. Where do we start, B? Easy. Breakfast! Then mm, blue, green, yellow, red. Yep, they're all here. Ah. Uh... Bartleby, look! It's happening! <gasps> Suggest a visit to Dilly Dally's Diorama of Dazzling Delight? Rainbow King! Happy Never Ending Rainbow Day, Your Majesty! And to you too, True and Bartleby. So, what's this Dilly with the Dazzly doodads? <laughs> Dilly Dally's Diorama of Dazzling Delight! It's full of the most wonderful treasures from all across the kingdom, like this zookalele. My good friend Dilly Dally gave it to me. You know Dilly Dally, the great explorer? Indeed I do. She is one of my dearest friends, and we both love music, so she always brings me back a musical souvenir from her travels. Can we meet her? Oh, goodness, no. Dilly Dally went on an adventure to find a magical instrument at the end of the never-ending rainbow last year. She's been gone a whole year? No wonder they call her Dilly Dally. Come to think of it, that is an awfully long time, even for Dilly Dally. I fear she may be missing. Missing? We have to go find her. Jumping, Juniper. It's far too dangerous, True. Anyone who crosses the never-ending rainbow must be prepared to face anything and come back before sunset. 
If anyone can find Dilly Dally and bring her back, it's me and Bartleby. Very well. But remember, at sunset, the never-ending rainbow will vanish for another year. We'll move kitty natty fast. Right, Drew? First things first, we need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> Thanks, Cumulo. We'll get you back to the carnival in time for the next ride. Do the wishing tree, please. Okay, wishes from the top. <gasps> Musical wishes. True, Bartleby. You like jazz? <laughs> Listen to this. We love Toozy, but we're in a real hurry. Yeah, we're going over the never-ending rainbow. To find Dilly Dally. The great explorer. As I remember, she never came back from her last expedition. Right, so we're heading over the rainbow to find her. That means you'll have to come back by the end of the day. What if you get stuck on the other side, too? We do have to hurry, Z, but we'll be just fine as long as we have the right wish help. Absolutely. Let's sit and have a think. <sighs> okay, True, how can the wishing tree help you? Well, maybe Dilly Dally didn't come back because she's trapped or needs some kind of help. We have to be prepared for anything. Right. We don't know what you might find over the rainbow. We might not know, but the wishing tree always shares the right wishes. Then it's up to me to figure out how to use them. You always do, True. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> wishing tree, share with me. Tiny wishes, one, two, three. Rooster. Wishing tree, please share with me. Rabbit. Magic power for you and me. Gotta, gotta. <laughs> What an exciting ensemble of wishes! Now, let's see what the Wishipedia says about their powers. This is Booster. Booster! This one will really blow you away. Booster can take a big breath and blow out a super powerful jet of air. I can't wait to see you in action, Booster. Who do we have next? Ah, uh, yes. This is Wampit. Wampit! As you know, Wampit is a stomping wish that just loves to stomp and smash the ground. Nice to see you again, Wampit. I don't know when we'll need your help, but I'm sure we'll have a smashing good time. Wampit! And finally, we have Koro Koro. <laughs> got it, got it, got it. A super rare wish. Koro Koro has grippy powers. It can help you walk on really slippery surfaces. Amazing! I'm glad to have you with us, Koro Koro. Gotta, gotta. Are you three ready for an adventure on the never ending rainbow? <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. We'll be back soon. I'm counting on it. To get back to the carnival, we can walk from here. Yep, it'll be nice to stretch our legs a bit. Besides, how long can it take to cross the never ending rainbow? We must be really high up. <laughs> when are we going to 
can't get to the end of this never-ending rainbow. I can't believe Dilly Dally came all this way by herself. I wonder what she was hoping to find. I'm hoping to find the world's biggest Zazuni juice. Mmm, super frosty with lots of ice cubes and... A fork! Um, I think a straw might work better for Zazuni juice, True. No, it's a fork in the rainbow. Look! Huh? Which way should we go? I've got this, True. My tail always knows which way to go. that away. Why did your tail pick that path? Easy. That other path has stairs. <laughs> Good call, Tail. Let's go. Well, it's nothing but smooth sailing from here on out. <gasps> right, True? Uh-oh. What do you mean, uh-oh? <gasps> oh, dear. It's like walking a tightrope. We just need to walk slow and steady. Whoa! I got you, True. Phew. Thanks. This is trickier than I thought. <laughs> Not for a red tabby kitty, Natty. Watch me, okay? Then just do what I do. <laughs> See, True? Easy peasy, rainbow squeezy. <laughs> Hang on, B. Gotcha. You. You, you okay, Bartleby? I am now, but I don't think I could have held myself up much longer. Whoa, we're high. This could work if we do it together. I'll hold you up. And you hold me up, okay? Yeah, okay, you got it. Steady. Easy. Easy. Ooh. Okay, come on. Okay. You can do it, True. Just don't look down because we're up so high. And you don't want to get dizzy. You don't even want to think about falling, because it'll be like... <laughs> oh, I can't look. Done. What? We're here. We made it. We did it. Go teamwork, right? <laughs> Thanks, B. Couldn't have done it without you. And look, we're almost at the top of the rainbow. Yeah, we can handle anything this wacky rainbow can throw at us. <laughs> I spoke too soon. <gasps> Come on! We'd better be quick if we're going to beat that storm. <laughs> Excuse me. Hi. We really need to get to the other side of the rainbow. Could you please let us through? <laughs> Aw, you're stuck and too full of rain to move? <laughs> What do we do, True? We can't just stroll through a lightning cloud. One wrong move and... <laughs> Not if we use some wish power to blow it away. Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, do I choose you? Wake up, Booster. Wish come true. Hi, Booster. See that big storm cloud over there? <laughs> It's stuck on the rainbow, and it needs our help. Let's give it a push with your super strong wind. Okay, Booster. Blow, blow, blow! <laughs> Look, it's... Ticklish. One more time, Booster. You're welcome. Thanks for not zapping us. <laughs> Great job, Booster. Now back in the pack. Uh -huh. Whoa. Be careful, B. It's a little slippery. <laughs> I know this is fun and all, but we don't have any brakes! Prepare for a crash landing! <laughs> wow. We made it, B. This is the end of the rainbow. <gasps> Dilly 
Dally must be somewhere on this island. Hello? Dilly Dally! Are you here? <gasps> Listen, do you hear a tink, tink, tink? You must have cat ears, True. I tink, 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 the tink, tink, tink is coming from over there. <gasps> Bartleby, look! It's her! Dilly Dally! Huh? What? Oh, my. Are you two lost? No, we're here to find you. I'm True, and this is Bartleby. We're friends of the Rainbow King. Bouncing bongos! Any friend of the Rainbow King is a friend of mine. Welcome to the Rainbow's End. I've taken pink to see your friends. Now listen up and looky here with big blue eyes and purple ears. I pucker up and give a blow. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, Dingle Dong, there's something wrong. I need that toot to toot along. Could use a stick and stucker tool to help unstuck that fuchsia jewel. I pucker up and give a blow. Song. Oh, Rainbow King. I miss him ever so dearly. I haven't seen him for a whole year. I could never be away from True that long. B but you're in luck. Because he sent us to find you and help get you home. Don't be a silly slide whistle. I'm not lost. I chose to stay here. Huh? I was collecting these magical crystals to make a kazufa flute as a souvenir for Rainbow King. <laughs> The very last crystal just won't budge. So I'm missing a note. And I am not leaving without it. <laughs> what kind of a friend would I be if I brought home a half-finished souvenir? <laughs> I do not think she's coming with us anytime soon. Mm -mm. We came here to rescue Dilly Dally, and we're not going home without her. Uh, well, we'd better hurry, True. The sun's gonna set soon, and you, me, and Dilly Dally will be stuck here until next never-ending rainbow day. Ooh, whoa. Okay, if Dilly Dally won't leave without the last crystal, maybe we can help get it out. Time for my second wish. Wompet, we need your wompin' stompin' power to shake a crystal loose. Wap wap. Okay, everybody, watch out! <gasps> Clapping castanets! What was that? Wombat's going to help you get that crystal out. You might want to stay off the ground for a little bit. Hop on! All right, Wompet, let's stomp. Womp it. Now back in the pack. Bop, bop. <laughs> wow! It made the rainbow glow. That's the power of the rainbow crystals. Isn't this the perfect souvenir for Rainbow King? He's going to love it, Dilly Dally. And we're going to give it to him today, right? As in, before the sun goes down. <gasps> we might be too late. Without the sun, there will be no rainbow to take us home. <gasps> Come on, let's get moving. <gasps> it's way too steep. Not for my super kitty naughty rainbow grip. <laughs> Remind me to sharpen my claws next time. Is there another way off this island, Dilly Dally? I was going to figure that part out after I got the crystal. <laughs> so we're stuck here until next never-ending rainbow day? Look on the bright side. We finished the kazofa flute. What? 
I didn't even bring any fizzy poof crackers. No! Still so many fishy poo flavors to try. Come now, Bartleby. Get a grip on yourself. That's it. I have just the thing to help us get a grip. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Coral Coral. Wish come true. Hi, Coral Coral. We need your help to climb to the top of that super steep rainbow. Go, Coral Coral! Uh, come on, hop in! Now, we all need to run as fast as we can. <laughs> it's working! Um, why is the rainbow flickering? The sun is setting. We're running out of time. Faster, everyone! It's all downhill from here! I can see Rainbow City! Ah, the rainbow is fading! We're not gonna make it! Dilly Dally, your Kazufa flute! Can you play it to keep the rainbow glowing? You betcha! <laughs> never have let them go over the rainbow. Oh, gruesome gray. I miss them so much. Wait, could it be? It's too late. The rainbow's gone. Oh, no. fluffy things I love. You're the best. Thanks, Cumulo. I knew I could always count on you. You too, Coro Coro. Coro Coro! Now back in the pack. <laughs> Grateful Green! Dilly Dally! Rainbow King! I missed you so much. I was so worried about you, old friend. I'm sorry I was away so long, but I just couldn't come home without a special treasure for you. Fantastic fuchsia, a kazufa flute. <laughs> <laughs> but Dilly Dally, as wonderful as your souvenirs are, there's no greater treasure than a true friend. Oh, Rainbow King, you're so right. And I have two new friends who cared enough to come look for me. Aww. I'm sorry you missed your never-ending rainbow day. Well, not the whole day. You didn't miss the grand finale. Rocketing red and booming blue. A special sight for me and you. Here it comes. The best part of never-ending rainbow day. Fill the sky with wondrous light. Find a friend and hug them tight. Like a nice cold Zazuni juice, Bartleby? It's the best way to cool off on a hot day at the beach. Just don't get brain freeze. How can my brain freeze when my head's so nice and warm, True. <laughs> brain freeze is what it feels like when you drink cold drinks too fast. So sip it slowly. Brain freeze! <sighs> Body freeze! Paw freeze! Oh, oh, oh. Ah, tail freeze! Tail freeze! Tail freeze, you anyone? I got it! Huh? <laughs> Go 
good, fantastic. <laughs> I'll go see if Rainbow King and his guards want some. It needs a grand entrance where I can welcome my visitors and plenty of windows to see the kingdom from. Oh, and don't forget the balcony. Oh. That's where I address my citizens. Mm -hmm. Thirsty, Your Majesty? Ah, oh, yes, thank you, True. My castle builders could use a break. Ice cold Zazuni juice. Oh. Mm. Don't drink it too fast, or else you'll get mm. brain freeze. Oops. <laughs> Ooh, a royal brain freeze. Oh, very refreshing. <laughs> so, what do you think? Does my sand castle look like my real rainbow castle? <laughs> Whoa! I can hardly tell them apart. Uh, what? Bartleby, did you finish the rest of the juice? <laughs> huh? What? Me? No! What? Did I? Wait, let, let me check. No shivers, no chills, no brain freeze. Nope! Wasn't me! Oh, hey! Hey! <gasps> A sea blob? Oh, you're so cute! Did you drink all our juice? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I bet you just wanted to cool off a bit. Blop, blop. Then let's go for a swim! Blop, blop. <laughs> yeah, this shade sure does the trick. A sea blob that doesn't want to go in the sea? That's not sea blobby at all. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Blop, blop. Whoa! Blop. I almost got blubbed big time! This is most unusual. Sea blubs hardly ever leave the water. Hmm. <gasps> the water's not cool at all. It's warm. Really warm. They're just trying to cool off in the shade. Maybe something's wrong with the living sea. Well then, we'd better check on it. Follow me. Come on, Barbie! Huh? Living Sea? Oh, yes, we go way back. I knew it when it was just a little puddle. <laughs> oh, wide and wonderful Living Sea, I ask that you please meet with me. Whoa. Rainbow King, how good to see you. These are my friends, True and Bartleby. They're very eager to meet you. The pleasure is all mine. The living sea doesn't look very lively today. If you don't mind me asking, um, your wetness, are you feeling okay? The heat, it makes me sleepy. Heat makes me sleepy too. The living sea must be part cat. But your water is always cold, even on hot days. That is correct. A family of ice stars keep me nice and cool. Ice stars? Yes, they keep the living sea cool. Just like the ice cubes in Bartleby's Zazuni juice. They really do. <laughs> <laughs> you can find them out in the deep water. But I am not feeling them today. Shocking pink! If something happened to the ice stars... Then the living sea would get warm. Too warm for the sea creatures to live in. We'll go and check on the ice stars right away. Oh. That would be most appreciated. You're welcome. Oh. Whoa! We're gonna need a blubber sitter soon. Our poor sea friends. I must try and cool them down. Good idea, Your Majesty. And while you do that, Bartleby and I will find the ice stars. Oh, Camila! Cumulo, let's fly out over the deep water of the living sea, please. Bye-bye. Water, water everywhere. Boy, the living sea should really be called the mega gigantic humongous sea. I guess your point is it's a really big sea. <laughs> huh? Hey, but I do see a couple of sailboats. <gasps> Those aren't sailboats. They must be ice stars. What do you think would happen if I lick one? <laughs> you probably get the biggest brain freeze ever. <laughs> <laughs>
They should be making the water cold. Are these ice stars working okay? I'll just give them my cat's paw test. <laughs> Brr! Paw freeze again! <laughs> hey, but didn't the Living Sea say there was a whole family of ice stars? Hmm. It is a big sea. Let's keep looking. That's it. A gentle breeze will cool you off. Huh? Be careful now. There's enough shade for everyone. Oh, my. Now there's no shade for anyone. Oh. Are you all right, my little sea blob? <laughs> well, that was lucky. <laughs> We're going to have to find a new way to keep you shady and cool. <laughs> hmm, that gives me an idea. No ice stars this way, no ice stars that way, no ice stars every which way! Whoa, yeah, getting dizzy. I might. Oh, oh. I've got you, B. Phew. Wait, I see one! Oh no, this is the ice star from earlier. I can see your paw print. Yeah, right! Wait a minute, there were two ice stars here before. Where'd the other one go? I don't know. We've looked everywhere and we still didn't find the other ice stars. And now we've even lost one. We need to figure this out and fast. Time for some wish help. Cumulo, to the wishing tree, please. Yeah! True, Bartleby, over here. Fern, engage blowing. <laughs> That's a fun way to keep cool. Fun and useful. I'm preparing the wishes for all types of weather. Windy weather, freezing weather, and sunny weather. Oh, so they'll be ready for all kinds of weather when they go out into the rainbow <laughs> kingdom with me. Exactly. That one's getting used to the cold. Don't get brain freeze. Oh, well, it passes. And this wish is getting used to hot, sunny days. Uh-oh, look out! Whoa! Whoa! I gotcha! <laughs> you okay, little buddy? Are you here to cool off, too? Actually, Z, we have to cool off the whole living sea. The ice stars are missing. Oh, no. So the living sea is getting warmer. The sea blobs are leaving the sea to cool off on the beach. That is serious. Let's have a think about this. We've been all over the Living Sea looking for the ice stars. But we couldn't find them. So maybe they went under the sea for some reason. That's very possible. So we need a wish to help us search underwater. And then we need to make sure the Living Sea stays cool until we can get the ice stars back on the job. Good thinking, Drew. You've got a plan and you're ready to do it. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Please share your wonderful wishes with me. Wishes. Let's see what the Wishopedia says about their powers. Your first wish is Chillsy. It is a freeze wish that blasts super cold beams to flash freeze anything. That's perfect. It'll help us cool down the living sea until we can find the missing ice stars. Are you up for chilling the sea, Chillsy? <laughs> That's a yes! 
But keep my tail out of this. Hasn't it shivered enough today? Oh. <laughs> Your next wish is... Bubba. It's an underwater wish that can help you breathe underwater, too. We've already searched above the sea. To search under it, we'll need all the help we can get. Yeah, the only time this cat touches water is if I'm out of Zazuni juice to drink. Yeah, no offense. <laughs> <laughs> For your last wish, you have Wampin. It's a stomping wish. Nothing makes it happier than Wampin and stomping. I don't know how a stomping wish will help us find high stars, but I'm glad to have you on board. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wishes with me. Good luck, True Mortal Bee. Thanks, Z. Hey, look! There's a new sandcastle on the beach. And this one's even bigger! It looks like the Rainbow King found a way to cool off the sea blubs. Yes, I'm delighted that they're finally comfortable now. But if the living sea doesn't cool down soon, it's going to get very crowded in there. We haven't found the ice stars yet, Your Majesty. But we have our three wishes to help us. Let's go, Cumulo. There it is! I'd know my paw print anywhere. Poor ice star. Cooling the living sea all by yourself. We brought you some help. Oh. All right, Chillsy. It's time to chill the living sea. Zip zap zoo, I trust you. Wake up, Chillsy. Wish come true. Hi, Chillsy. Let's see how far you can ice things over. Full power. <laughs> Great job, Chelsey. You can chill out now from all your chilling. Oh, so much better. Thank you for the chill, True. You're welcome, Living Sea. But you're so big, we can't freeze all of you. It helps quite a bit. But without my ice stars, I cannot stay cool. We'll find the rest of the Ice Star family. I promise! <sighs> okay, Team Milo, you keep looking for Ice Stars above the Living Sea while Bartleby and I look under it. Or, just thinking out loud here, Cumulo and I could stay up here. No soggy, drippy kitty that way. <laughs> oh, well, catch the cat again! <laughs> Freeze again? Are you kidding me? I am not having a good tail day. Aww, another sea blub. I bet you want to be in the colder water here. Hey! Whoa! Whoa! No! Careful! We just made that ice! Aww, and I guess you want someone to play with too. Why, oh why, do other creatures find me so irresistible? You are pretty cuddly, Beef. Why don't you keep little Blubby company while I go see if the missing ice stars are underwater? Bubba, time to do your stuff. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bubba! Wish come true! Hi, Bubba. Let's go under the sea. Find the rest of your family. A rope? What's a rope doing under the sea? <gasps> the ice star's being pulled away! Someone's taking it! La -dee -da -da now, isn't this better than jumping around and cracking all the ice? <laughs> A ball here, put me down. Uh-oh. I forgot to say gently. Oh look, 
The last ice star is leaving. <laughs> the last ice star is leaving? That's bad. <laughs> and this is worse. Hold me! <laughs> sea Blob, where are you going? Whoa! <sighs> hey, wait. What am I worried about? Ninja kitties can jump from ice flow to ice flow, right? One, two, Ninja Cat, go! Hiya! Oh, 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 oh. oh, two! Must stay dry, must stay dry, must stay dry! Huh? Oh, true. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'd hug you, but, well, you have a big Baba helmet on. It's awkward. We'll have a big hug later, B. Okay. Right now, we have an ice star to catch. Cumulo! <laughs> did you find any more ice stars, Cumulo? Mm -hmm. Neither did I, but I know what's going on now. The missing ice stars didn't sink or float away. They're being taken away. <laughs> Taken? Why would someone want to take an ice star? I'm not sure. That's what we're going to find out. Bubba, thanks for helping me underwater. <laughs> I know the ice star went this way, but I don't see it anymore. Hey, maybe my sea blood buddy saw it. <laughs> yes! Follow that pointing flipper. Look, there's a clue. A raft and some paddles, and they're still wet. This must be where they brought the ice star. <laughs> well, something's making it cold around here. Do you hear that? The ice stars! They're all here! They are! Me, yo! <laughs> um, excuse me? It's okay. We didn't mean to startle you. I'm True, and this is Bartleby. They're wondering how we found their cove, and I'm wondering how I know that. Bartleby, you speak rockish? <laughs> well, a little. I mean, you know, cats are very good talkers. We followed you here. Are you the ones who moved the ice stars? They say they brought the ice stars here to cool down their home. They really like to play on the ice. But the ice stars belong in the living sea. Without them, it's too warm for the creatures who live in the water. <laughs> they say they're sorry. They just wanted to freeze the lagoon and go skating. They didn't know they were warming up the living sea. <laughs> But they sure cooled things down in here. All the ice stars in one spot might be too much, Chill. We have to move the ice stars out of here. Come on, everyone. All right, everyone, get ready. And pull! It's frozen solid. <laughs> we'll never get the ice stars out of here until things warm up again. And we only have one wish left, Womp It. How can a stomping wish help us warm up the canyon? Hmm. Wait. Maybe we don't need warmth. When the living sea was frozen, do you remember how the sea blob bounced on the ice and cracked it? Yeah, and then I almost got wet. Oh, yeah. Cats, don't forget stuff like that. Wombat could do the same thing. Uh. It can stomp and stomp until all the ice breaks. Then the ice stars will be free and we can get them out of here. I am Woo! stupid yeah! with joy at this idea! Time for some wish help. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! <laughs> Wake up, Wompit! <laughs> wish come true! Okay, Wompit. Ready to stomp it? <laughs> Let's get stomping! With the Wompit Bam Slam, we're jumping up and down! With the Wapid Bam Slam, we're stomping all around. With the Wapid Bam Slam, can you hear that sound? It's the Wapid Bam Slam of our big feet on the ground. Woo! Jumping up, jumping down. Paws are up, paws are down. Huge hop, Wapid Bob. Keep on going, don't you stop. With the Wapid Bam Slam, all smiles on a frown. With the Wapid Bam Slam, we're breaking it down. With the Wapid Bam Slam, was there ever any doubt? That jumping up and down is what Wapid Stomping did it! All the ice stars 
you're free! Time to get the Ice Star family back home to the living sea. How does the water feel now? Blop, blop. All nice and cool again. <laughs> <laughs> When winter comes and my surface is frozen, the rock creatures are welcome to come skating on me, True. Thank you, Living Sea. Did you hear that? La -da -da -la -da -da. Oh, it is such a relief to feel cool again. I feel a wave coming on. Whoa! <laughs> Bartleby, I thought cats and water don't mix. <laughs> they don't. Cool. But the sea blood got me covered. Whoa! They keep me nice and dry. Whoa! Whoa! For now. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> the kitty natty. Front paw, purple. <laughs> that means I have to reach way over there. <laughs> is that? It is impossible. What is it, Bee? It's a message mouse. A message mouse? Ooh. Whoa! It must have a secret message for me. Whoa! <laughs> 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 You've been Bartlebeed. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> gotcha! Ta-da! What's the message? Who's it from? Only the most secret group ever. The Kitty Natty. The kitty what -y? The kitty natty. <gasps> Master Bartleby, the kitty natty requests your presence. Please follow this message mouse to the Black Tabby Dojo. Let's get a kitty up, True. Slow down, Bartleby. Can't lose it now. Gotta get to the dojo. What's a dojo? It's a place for kitty cats to train and become stealth ninjas. Hi-ya, hoo ha Whoa! <laughs> and I tripped. You're gonna be a ninja cat? Yeah, well, you know, I already am. Well, uh, a teeny bit. I only have my yellow tabby belt. That means I'm just a beginner. Now I can finally go for my red tabby belt, no matter how long it takes. It takes a long time? Does that mean... You'll be gone for a long time? Look, I'll come back with cool new ninja moves. You know, like hi-ya and meow and like that. <laughs> yeah, okay. Those moves are pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! We lost the message mouse. No, 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 we didn't lose it. We're here. I'm true, and you know Bartleby. I am Shadow. Ah. I am Silverclaw. Welcome to the Black Tabby Dojo. Whoa! Red Tabby Belt, Red Tabby Belt, gonna get the Red Tabby Belt. If you pass our many, many tests. Until then, please say goodbye to your friend. Oh, right. I'll miss you, True. I'll miss you too, B. But I know you'll do great. Goodbye, friend. See you soon. sound of this river. I'm waiting for my friend Bartleby. He's gonna be a while. He's in ninja cat training. The Black Tabby Dojo is where the Kitty Natty master their strength, balance, and focus. Our training stations await you. The Kitty Natty have no fear. We live in shadow, we disappear. Ah! Our perfect balance is no trick. 
You must be careful, those birds prick. That's my backside. Nothing can distract our mind. <laughs> Perfect focus hard to find. Learn from us, young Bartleby, and soon you'll be a kitty Nazi. I did it! I did a tail pull! Did you see that? I did one! Me! Now pull yourself up. <sighs> Does almost stop count? No! <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Pretty sure I'm okay. Again. <gasps> hop little acorn, one, two, three. Hop little acorn, hop to me. Hop little acorn, one, two, three. Hop little acorn, hop to me. Water is not supposed to do that. What is it? What's wrong? Oh no, your home is full of water. Don't worry, little friend. We'll get to the bottom of this. I gotta keep my focus. <laughs> Stay focused, Bartleby. Come on. Something is not right in the forest. I will investigate. Again. Hurry, everybody! Where is all this water coming from? That hill looks like it's going to... Whoa! Geyser! I have to stop it from gushing before everything floods. This log uh, is too, too heavy. Ooh, this mushroom might plug it. <laughs> there. Oh, no! Whoa! <laughs> Flying mushroom. Unusual. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Master Bartleby. You have discovered many new ways to fall down. That was the mushroom's fault. Again. <laughs> Mushroom flies back. Very unusual. <laughs> hmm. Well, that didn't work. I can't fix this on my own. I need to get some help from the witching tree. Cumulo, over here. <laughs> To the wishing tree, please. <gasps> Where's True going? I hope she's okay. <gasps> ah! Oh, I shadow. <laughs> hey, uh, I have to go. Um, check on someone, something outside the dojo. You are free to leave any time, but once you go, you cannot return. The Black Tabby Dojo will disappear the moment you leave it. No dojo. No. No red tabby belt? No. Oh. Um, well, um, you know, I'm 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 sure everything is fine. I'm, I'm just probably just worrying too much. Yeah, that's what I'm probably doing. I'm just probably worrying too much. <laughs> Ready? Uh -huh. Follow me. La, 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 la. Perfect pitch. Wow, that sounds amazing. La. <laughs> <laughs> hey, True, isn't this cool? I am testing some Wish's musical abilities. Go ahead, try it. La. La. Bravo! Thanks, Wishes. We can play more later. La. 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 Uh, where is Bartleby today? Um, he's with some 
forest friends training for um cat stuff. <gasps> you mean the kitty natty? You know about the kitty natty? The ancient tribe of cat ninjas as old as history itself? Of course. That's actually why I'm here. The river outside of their dojo was rising and flooding forest creatures out of their homes. I'm sure we can find a solution. Let's sit and think. <gasps> this sounds serious. It is. I was lying by the river, not far from their dojo. Then all of a sudden, boosh, a huge geyser of water blasted all over. Fascinating. The water is spraying everywhere, so I need a wish to stop it. Then I need to figure out where all the water is coming from. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It's time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. Selections. Let's look them up in the Wishopedia. Your first wish is Grozer. Oh, yes. Interesting. What? Tell me. It can make any vegetation grow larger. <laughs> Veggie what? Taste and who? You know, greenery. Like vegetables and plants. Ooh, there are lots of plants in the forest. I could grow one larger to plug the geyser. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> now your second wish is Bubba. Oh, listen to this. It's a swimming wish that lets you breathe underwater. That's perfect. If I'm going to find out what's causing the flood, I'll be glad to have Bubba with me. And your last wish is Hushabai, a musical wish. It can play a wide selection of soothing songs. Cool, but I'm not sure anyone's gonna need to take a nap. Maybe you can use it for yourself after. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Z. Come on, wishes, let's go stop the flood. <laughs> We are Kitty Nutty. We do not giggle while training. Huh? We are Kitty Nutty. We do not purr while training. <laughs> right. No purring, no giggling. Super. True! True! Look at me! Leap! Again. Whoa! The geyser's still gushing water. Okay, Grozer, are you ready? Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Grozer! Wish come true! Can you make a mushroom big enough to plug the geyser like a cork in a bottle? Uh huh. Then grow, grow, grow! Uh -huh. Uh-oh! Here comes more water! <sighs> it worked! Thanks, Grozer! <laughs> We've stopped the water above ground, but it's still flooding your home underground. Don't worry. 
I'll find out where the water is coming from. What is he doing? <sighs> he has been weakened by the power of the feather. What news of the forest? The girl named True is working to solve a problem involving water. True? You, my True? Isn't she great? Oh, uh... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I have no idea how. I, I don't even like feathers. Until I can figure out how to stop the water from flooding your home, I hope the snuggly spot will do. <laughs> oh no! Mini geysers? Lots of them? And they're headed for the dojo! I've got to warn Bartleby. I'm invisible. Can you see me? Yes. Be like Shadow. Think like Shadow. Got it. And how about now? Ah, water! I'm wet! I'm wet everywhere! Towel! <laughs> ah! Bartleby! Hang on! True! You saved me! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! Thank you. How did you know I was in trouble? I saw many geysers heading towards the dojo. But you can stop them, right? I mean, you brought some wishes, right? Of course. But well, I'm coming with you. Bartleby, we must remind you, if you leave this dojo, you cannot return. I know, but I have to help my friend. Come from. The ground got rumbly, and then my feet got tumbly, and then the river started rising. The river! Bartleby, that's it. If the river water is rising, maybe there's a problem in the river. If I can go underwater, I can find the solution. But true, you can't go into the river. I can with some wish help. Bubba, I need you. Let's zap zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Bubba! Wish come true! Good day for a swim, Bubba! Hmm, looks like all the river water is under that hill. Which the big geyser is sitting on. But why is the river water rising so fast? Let's go back that way. There, look! A puppy puff's in trouble. And it's blocking the river's other path. Excuse me, Mr. Puffy Puff, but you're blocking one of the river's paths. Are you stuck? Can I please unstick you? <laughs> shh, shh, it's okay. I didn't mean to scare you. Aw, you are scared, aren't you? Aw, I'll bet when you get scared, you get puffy. Am I right? Hmm, so to get you to unpuff, I'll need to calm you down. <gasps> My third wish! hush -a -bye. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, hush -a -bye. Wish come true! <laughs> we need some relaxing music, hush -a -bye. Can you do it? You still look a little worried. Let me sing you a song. Hush a hush a hush a bye, don't be afraid. No need to cry, hush a hush a bye. Think sweet thoughts, then close your eyes. Go to sleep, hush a hush a bye. Swim free, Mr. Puffy Puff. And the river's flowing again. You did it, hush a bye. Thank you. Time to go back in the pack. 
on, Bubba. Let's go see if the mini geysers have stopped. with just your tail? You mean I was just like the kid in Addy Masters? Yes, you were. We saw everything. You did? I'm... I'm sorry I left my training at the dojo, but I had to help True. And if that means I can't... Huh? You made the right choice, Bartleby. Indeed. You did what Kitty Natty are trained to do. You focused your mind and body to help those in need. And it is our opinion that you have earned a red tabby belt. A red tabby belt? Meow! That's the most amazing thing ever! Way to go, me! Way to go, me! Way to go... <coughs> I'm... <coughs> <laughs> Bartleby. Now you are a true Kitty Natty red belt. Thank you, O oh Masters of Kitty Natty. Your true friend is waiting. Look, True! I'm a red tabby kitty! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. No, it's not that right. We're all good? Okay. Come on, True. Let's go play. <laughs> Ninja cat or not, you're still the Bartleby I know and love. Switcheroo! Ugh. Phew! Bartleby, could you pass me an empty flower pot, please? Oh! <laughs> You're not Bartleby! Good work, little helpers! I just wonder where my big helper Bartleby went. Fishy poof crackers. Mm. Ah! It's raining! It's raining, it's pouring, and Bartleby <laughs> is snoring. <laughs> Are you forgetting what day it is today? Is it sleep on the grass day? Nope. Brush my fur day? Nope. Eat a big lunch day? No, silly. We're going to help Griselda with her gardening today. Whoa now! Stop right there. Where you think you're going with True's flowers? It's okay, Bee. I'm giving them to Griselda so she can add them to her garden. Aw, that's so nice. Okay, enough chatter. Let's get these flowers onto the wagon. Whoa, what was that? Ooh, it's some kind of crystal. <sighs> smells pepperminty. What kind of crystal smells pepperminty? Hmm, we might be able to tell if we clean it up a little. <gasps> Something's happening! <laughs> I don't know what just happened. I think this crystal just made your juice ball switch places with that shovel. Wow! What do you know? An actual working for real switch em a jig. Switch em a ball. Yeah, switch em a thing. Switcheroo. Switcheroo. <laughs> that's good, yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> Have you ever seen anything so amazing? Just think of all the things we can switch. She has my ball! She has my ball! <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 
Jesus. awesome! <laughs> Don't let me try, let me try. What just happened? I don't know. Ah! You're me. And you're an extremely handsome kitty cat. The switcheroo switched our bodies. I can't be a cat. What about me? How am I supposed to be a human? Or a girl? I don't know how to be either. We <laughs> have to switch back. <laughs> how do you hold anything with these paws? Oh, what are all these fingers for? All they do is wiggle around. When are you going to get here to help me with my garden? The Grismos are ruining everything. Help me, True. She thinks you're me. Say something. Like what? Wait, who said that? Um. Hold on, just uh... let me get. We're on our way. See you soon. <laughs> on our way? True, we can't go to Griselda's like this. We have to. We promised we'd help. Grab that crystal and we'll try and figure it out there. Okay, but the second we get there, I want to be a cat again. Oh, I don't know how you people live without fur. I'm freezing! Hmm. Put the bench where the bush is, and the bush where the bench is. Moving past. Hmm. No, no, that's not right either. Put them back where they were. <laughs> okay, let's try switching back before we talk to Griselda. Whoa! <laughs> Phew. It's hard to get a grip on anything with these paws. Who is that back there? Oh, no. Here she comes. Let her do all the talking. <laughs> yeah, for a change. Uh, Hello. Hi, True, Bartleby, you two sound weird. <laughs> anyway, da-da-da-da. Everything that's here should be there, and everything that's there should be here. And True! What are you doing? Uh, hands still dirty from, uh, gardening. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Surprise! Surprise! Aww, that's so sweet of you, True. <gasps> A crystal? It smells like peppermint! It'll be the perfect centerpiece for my garden! Yay! True, we need the switcheroo back. Why didn't you tell her it wasn't a gift? I couldn't say anything without showing her that we switched. Grismos, put this on the top of the bird bath right away. It's my new centerpiece, so guard it for all you're worth. Whew, all this gardening is exhausting. Time for a beauty nap. Oh, and I want that crystal to be sparkling so I can see my face in it. So be sure to shine it every couple seconds. Thank you! Polish it! Every few seconds? Grismos! No! Oreo! Sweet stuff! Yay! I really need that crystal back. No. -uh. But everything's getting switched. No. Uh, -uh. Mm. uh oh. Huh? Ooh. Mm -hmm. We have to stop all this switching. Never fear. This ninja cat, um, girl, we'll get it back. Uh, Bartleby. Hi. <laughs> I don't know what to do next with your body. I'm the cat. I can leap. Ninja cat, go! Ooh. A feather duster. Dirty trick. <laughs> no claws, no claws! <laughs> uh, I'm used to landing on my paws. <laughs> Look! The beams are going everywhere, True. Even Rainbow City. Yeah, mustard. Yeah, yeah. 
there's no way we can fix this on our own. We need some wish help. Oh, Cumulo! <laughs> Hi, Cumulo. Whoa. Please take us to the wishing tree. You move over here, please. And Bouncy Wishes, you can move over here. Hi, Z! Greetings, True and Bartleby. I'm just switching some of the wishes spots in the wishing tree. Ah, uh, more switching. Can't things just stay the same anymore? True? There's something wrong with your voice. You sound like Bartleby. <laughs> no, no. My voice sounds the same as always, Z. <laughs> no, Bartleby. My eyes must be seeing things. My ears must be hearing things. Oh, I must be dreaming. Wishes, help me wake up, please. I can't be sleeping on the job. <gasps> Ooh. Thanks, Bouncing Wish. It's okay. You're not dreaming. B and I switched bodies. Yeah, True dug up this crystal thing we call the switcheroo. And it zapped us. And now I'm a human, and she's a cat. <sighs> I miss having fur. Great gravity. What a problem this is. Come, let's sit and have a think about this. <sighs> How can the wishes help you, True? Well, first we need to get the switcheroo back from the Grismos. Griselda thinks True gave it to her as a gift, but she did not. Oh, that's, that's awkward. Really awkward. But maybe a wish can help us give Griselda something else that she'll like even more. And once you get the crystal, you can switch yourselves back and everything will be normal, right? Uh, not exactly. We saw the switcheroo beams blasting towards Rainbow City. <laughs> what? Ooh, huh, landed on my feet. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to get your three wishes. Wait, True's the one who asked for the wishes, but right now I'm True. The wishing tree always knows the real true. But she will need her wish pack. All right. Huh, perfect fit. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. These are some great wishes, Bartleby. Uh, I mean, true. Let's check the Wishopedia. Your first wish is Snorful. This smelling wish has a very strong nose for sniffing things out. If it's strong enough to move things too, it could help us push all the switched out stuff back again. <laughs> Strong sneezer, too, I bet. Your second wish is Zillion, one of my favorites. It can make exact copies of things, whether you just need one copy or a hundred copies. What could I make a copy of that'll help me? <gasps> the switcheroo! I could give a copy of it to Griselda so I can get the real one back! <laughs> And your third wish is... Ah, yes. Look-see. The seeing wish. It can help you spot things that our eyes can't see. Hmm. I don't know why we'd need a seeing wish. <laughs> but I'm sure I'll find some way to use it. You always do, True. Thank you, Z. And thank you, Wishing Tree, for sharing your wonderful wishes with me. You're the best, Z. Good luck, True Bartleby.
be a YouTube bottle be true. Flowerous Magnificus. <laughs> Hello, Bee. <laughs> a, a leaping lemon yellow. Now I'm a bee. <laughs> well, I'd better practice my buzzing. <laughs> bzz, 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 bzz. Yay! Uh. Huh? Yuck! Ice cream break. B, we need the switcheroo first. Ice cream later. Oh, right. It's time to get it back and put a stop to all the switching. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Zillion. Wish come true. Ready to go? Mm -hmm. Hi, Grismos. I really need that crystal back. No. I'm not going to take it. I'm just going to make a copy. I don't care. Perfect. And we'd like one copy of the switcheroo, please. But don't copy its powers. Uh, a rested princess is a happy princess. Okay, everyone. Let's see how things are looking in my... <gasps> my crystal! <laughs> 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 Weird. Did everyone just get taller? Ugh! I'm a dog. Why am I a dog? I'm really sorry, Griselda. Uh, why are you talking like true? You and your Grismos weren't supposed to have my crystal. It's a switcheroo and it switches things. And people. And cats. It switched our bodies. That's so weird. Ah! That's me. I switch bodies with my fruity kins. Ah, what's that? It's 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 chasing me. Yeah. Whoa! The switcheroo! Right behind you, True. Got it. Oh, oh. I'm getting paw prints all over it. Uh oh. Oh no! How are we gonna find the real switcheroo now? <laughs> Don't feel bad, Zillion. It's not your fault you got startled. You're a good helper. I can't believe I'm a dog. A really adorable dog, but a dog! Fruky, no! Poise and grace, be a princess! Come on, B. We gotta find the real switcheroo. I'm with you, Troob. <laughs> this isn't my stop. Okay, things are looking really switched up around here. Where did all these trees come from? <laughs> oh, yeah. Bottle look! I found it! Uh, true? <sighs> it's like a giant game of crystal hide and seek. How are we going to know which one's the real switcheroo with all the copies? Well, first we'll have to gather up every last crystal there is. Okay, but how can we find all the crystals if we can't even see where they all are? We don't need to see them. We just have to smell them. Oh, yeah. They smell pepperminty. Zip zap zoo, I choose you. Wake up, snorkel. Wish come true! Hi, Snorful. 
I need you to find all the crystals wherever they are. They smell like peppermint. Can you sniff them out for us? good with these finger thingies. I guess that's all of them. Thanks, Snorkel. Now we gotta figure out which is the real switcheroo. Luckily, I have a system. Grab them. Nope. 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 Can I help? No, I got it. No. Nope. Arm cramp, arm cramp. This is gonna take forever. There it is again. Nope. None of those crystals was the switcheroo. Maybe it's one of these. There has to be a way to find out which crystal's the real switcheroo without having to polish them all. Let's think about this. Our last wish is look-see. It can see things our regular eyes can't. Right. What's on the switcheroo that we can't see? My paw print! I left paw prints on it when I tried to grab it! That's what Luxie can search for to find the real switcheroo! That's a super incredible idea! <laughs> Let's do this! Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Luxie! <laughs> Wish come oh. true! Hi, Luxie. Huh? We're looking for one special crystal that has a kitty paw print on it. Are you ready to look? Where is it? Hmm. <gasps> kitty paw print! Ninja kitty true go! <laughs> nice tail control! You know what they say, B. Practice makes perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Luxie. You've been a huge help. Great job, True. Now, um, switch us back, quick. Okay, Bartleby. Whiskers. No whiskers. Tail. No tail. Kitty sense of self-importance. Uh, no tail. I'm back! <laughs> I am so happy, B. But we've got a lot more stuff to switcheroo. Come on! Can't we celebrate for a second? Okay. One second dance oh! party. Okay, let's go. Let's switch a room with finger two. No sense wasting all that practice. Thanks, Cumulo. Nice switcheroo, True. <gasps> Tail wagging isn't fun anymore. Ah, that crystal looks so gorgeous in my garden. I didn't realize it wasn't for me. Great news, Griselda Fruki. You can have all the crystal copies. Just don't ask me to count how many there are. I can't count that high. Yay! Ah! 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 Chase him back, you! Quick, chase him back! Oh, Dr. Fruki! <laughs> I kissed a cat! Wait, tail gone? Fingers back? Ability to curtsy? Perfect. <laughs> So, uh, what are you gonna do with that switcheroo, True? Well, I know the perfect spot where it won't cause any more trouble. There. Safe and sound, back in the ground. <laughs> <laughs> True's birthday party. It's my birthday.
Chu's birthday, it's Chu's birthday, and we're gonna drop a birthday beat for you. Got my invite, so excited, got a present, can't wait. Hey, you Grismos, get my apron, there's a big cake to bake. It's my royal proclamation that we all celebrate. Our favorite person in the kingdom, so let's make her day great. It's my birthday. My best birthday. And I get to share a special day with you. <laughs> Happy birthday, Drew. Aw, thanks, B. Okay, are you ready for an amazing birthday? Of course. Wait, I still have so much to do for the party tonight. No, you don't. Cuz I planned your whole party. Really? Yep, it's my gift to you. I'm gonna make sure you have the most amazing birthday ever. You won't have to do a single thing today, True. Aw, B, you're the best. I know, but we've got some serious birthdaying to do. Let's get going. It's my birthday. Ready for a treat? I made something extra special. Guess what it is? <laughs> it's you! Yeah! I call them Bartle Biscuits. I got the idea from the mirror. <laughs> hmm. Which part should I eat first? My ears, of course. Good choice. Hey, this kind of tastes like Stranilla. <gasps> Are we having Stranilla cake at my party? You'll have to wait and see. With wiggly jiggly jelly and bubble chew icing? Mm-hmm. Yeah. And as your best friend, I of course knew you'd want all those different flavors together. It's definitely not just a basic mellow berry cake. Aw, uh -huh, Bee. You know me so well. Can I borrow your face bubble thingy for a non-birthday emergency? Sure. Here, have another Bartle biscuit. Try eating it as loud as you can. Loud enough? Griselda, answer my face bubble. Griselda, we have a birthday emergency. <gasps> you ran out of glitter balloons? No, we need to change the mellow berry cake into a straw nilly wiggly jiggly jelly bubble chew icing cake. Oh, that's no problem. Baking isn't hard. All you need is a princess's delicate touch. Uh, uh, uh. But you don't have a recipe. Princesses don't need recipes. We're amazing at everything we do. Right, Grismos? Uh... Okay, but don't forget the cake is the most important part of our party. Obvi. That's why I'm in charge of it. Okay, Grismos, you heard Bartleby. Mellow Berry's out and Stranello Wiggly Jiggly Jelly Bubble Chew Icing is in. Where's my super fast ever rise powder? Let's add more. More is better. <laughs> Everything good with the decorations? Okay, great. Talk to you soon. Aww. All aboard the Mushroom Town Birthday Express. Hey, yeah! Everyone's on their way? You bet. Right on schedule. Great! Hey, Bingo Bango! You know the way, right? You turn left at the never ending forest? Oh, yeah. Um, okay, I'll take that as a yes. Who's ready for ice cream lunch? Ice cream for lunch? We can do that? Sure, it's your birthday. Let's put the scream in ice cream birthday lunch. Perfect. Ready to bake. Uh, uh. Ugh, what are you Grismos doing? Step aside. This needs a princess's delicate touch. <laughs> Baking would be hard if I wasn't so good at it. Okay, Bartleby. I think that's enough. Just one last thing to top it off. A fishy poof cracker. Whoa. Whoa. This 
to my party. Ah, uh, you weren't gonna wear that anyway. Cuz we're gonna get you a new outfit! Really? But only after you finish all your ice cream. Challenge accepted. No, 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 no. This simply won't do. We need to make it pop. Because all together, more, more is better. better. See? Birthday! 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 birthday. Nothing's going to stop this express bus to True's birthday party. Except for this delicious goo. Hey, what's the hold-up? I gotta get to True's party. Pardon me, I have a party to attend. Can you please move it along? Yeah, what's going on? Okay, this is perfect. Ready to see my new birthday suit? Is it as cute as mine? I love it! In that fabulous outfit, you are going to rock this party. What's that? I don't know, but we better go check it out. What's going on? A traffic jam? Juice party bus! Oh, hello, Rainbow City bus. Shouldn't you be on your way to someplace very important? Mayhaps? Well, I should, but as you can see... <laughs> I'm stuck in this delicious goo! It does smell yummy. It is yummy! And it tastes a lot like bubble chew icing. Griselda! Oh. Well, that's wiggly and jiggly enough for a regular cake eater. But this cake needs to be princess level wiggly jiggly. More is better. Hey, Griselda, do you know anything about some bubble chew icing traffic jam? Bartleby, I'm in the middle of making the most important cake of my career. I need my space. I'll talk to you later. But Toodles! Now, where were we? Ah, yes. Ah! Ah! are fine. You don't really need to do any hero stuff today, do you? I don't know, Bee, but let's go and check it out anyway. What happened? Is everything okay? <laughs> These trees are blocking your path? Hmm. Well, maybe the three of us can move it. Ah, true. Can it wait? We still have that ooey-gooey traffic jam to clean up. If we don't help, no one will be able to come through the forest. <laughs> bingo, bingo! Party decorations! We need to move this tree right now! <laughs> That's the spirit? <laughs> this isn't working. Time for some wish help. To the wishing tree! Birthday, True. I uh, wasn't expecting to see you until your party. The party will have to wait, Z. There was some kind of earthquake. Yeah, we felt it up here too. It knocked over trees in the never ending forest and no one could get around. And there's a sticky situation in Rainbow City. A sticky, gooey situation. And it's causing a huge traffic jam. Oh, that does sound serious. But sit and have a think. Okay, True, how can...
can the wishing tree help you? Well, first we need to get the trees back upright in the never-ending forest. Yeah, and let's not forget, they're super heavy. Then we have to get the gooey glob off the Rainbow City streets. The wishing tree has heard you, True. It is time to get your three wishes. I'm ready. Wishing tree, wishing tree, please share your wonderful wishes with me. <laughs> wishing tree. Wait till you see what the Wishipedia says about these. First up is Lifto. Lifto! This wish is incredibly strong. It can lift anything you place on top of it. Just give it a spin. Wow! Lifto, you can help us get all the trees standing again. Lifto! And next we have... Pumpa. Pumpa! This wish can blow air into anything, like a flat tire. Or a balloon bouquet. Pumpa! Or a giant gooey glob like the one causing the traffic jam. Maybe Pumpa can blow it into a bubble and float it away. Pumpa! Oh, you're gonna love this one. Meet Kakaraka, one of the most powerful wishes of all. Kakaraka! Kakaraka is a bursting wish that can help break large things into smaller pieces. Wow! I'm not sure how I can use Kakaraka just yet, but I'm sure it'll be a blast. <laughs> <laughs> Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Thanks, Z. Bye, Z. Good luck, you two. We're back. Thanks for waiting. Let's see if we can move these trees off the road for you. Time for my first wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Lifto. Wish come true. Hey ho, Lifto. Hey. See all those fallen trees? Hey. We need you to lift them back up again. Which will clear the path and allow everyone to get where they need to go. <laughs> oh, I'm just excited about getting people moving again. Go Lifto! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Come on back down, Lifto! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's get the rest of this path clear. <laughs> Thanks, Lifto! Now back in the pack. Come on, B. We've got to get back to Rainbow City to deal with that gooey, globby mess. Oh, what is more important than taking care of my beautiful skin? Uh oh! Hi, everyone! True! Thank goodness! I don't think I can eat any more of this delicious goo! Okay, time for my second wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you! Wake up, Pumpa! Wish come true! Hi, Pumpa! Pumpa! That giant glob has really gooed up our friends. Ready to help clean it up? Pumpa! Great! 
I bet we can blow a huge bubble out of that goo. Pump of power, go! Oh, yay! <laughs> Pumpa! Thanks, Pumpa. That really blew me away. Now back in the back. Thanks, Drew. See you later. You're welcome. Bye. Well, I was hoping you wouldn't need to do any of that hero stuff today, but you took care of that pretty easily. I did, didn't I? Hey, Griselda. Ugh. True. I wish you the most happy birthday. Ugh. Aw. Thanks, Griselda. May I please talk to Bartleby about nothing to do with cakes? Sure thing. <laughs> okay, what is it, Griselda? Bartleby! This cake is not doing what I told it to do. Stay! No! Bad cake! The words bad and cake are not something I want to hear. What's going on? Well, it turns out more is not always better. The Stronilla cake layer is a bit bigger than I expected. Like, oops, it's so big we're going to be eating cake for a week. More like, oops, it's too big for the oven. And the kitchen? And maybe the house. Ah, come quick! I'm not sure I can hold this much longer! Ah! What was that? Uh, that is... Super huge birthday cake? Super huge, totally on purpose birthday cake! B, you shouldn't have. I really shouldn't have. Uh, that'll be for me. That'll be. The strangest thing just happened. I'm suspended in this scrumptious Stranilla sponge cake. I've been stuck in a traffic jam before, but never a traffic jelly. This cake is going straight to Fergie's obedience school. I <laughs> There might be a small problem with the party. Oh, you mean that giant birthday cake that fell over on Mushroom Town and has all our birthday guests stuck inside the delicious ooey gooey icing? Uh-huh. That wasn't part of my plan. True, I hate to ruin your day, but I think I really need your help now. It's okay, Bee. Helping people is my favorite thing to do. Oh, Cumulo! Hi, Cumulo. We've got a cake problem. To the Mushroom Town. This cake is huge. And it looks delicious, too. Should we just eat our way through? Because I'd be okay with that. Well, as yummy as that sounds, it might take too long. It's time for my third wish. Zip, zap, zoo, I choose you. Wake up, Kakaraka. Wish come true. Hi, Kakaraka. We have a giant cake problem. We need your help. Kakaraka! Ready, Kakaraka? Kakaraka! We're rooting for you, Kakaraka! Kakaraka! Okay, now wait for my signal. On my count. Three, two, one. Kakaraka! Party started! Hey! <laughs> so, I guess we should just leave the party planning to you next year, huh? What do you mean, Bartleby? Well, nothing worked out the way I wanted it to, and besides, you don't even have a cake! Bartleby, I had the most incredible day! Mostly because I got to spend it with you. I loved the picnic and the ice cream lunch, and I love my outfit! Everything you did today came from your heart, and that made this the best birthday ever! Huh? What? Cupcakes! It's raining cupcakes! I don't 
don't think anyone's had a birthday party like this before. Kakaraka! Way to go, Kakaraka! Zoo zip zap wishes in my pack. <laughs> Happy, Happy birthday, birthday true. true! Best, Best party, party ever! This party is amazing! Thanks, everyone! This is even better than the best birthday party ever, and it's all thanks to Bartleby. Great, Great job, Bartleby. Bartleby! Ah, shucks. Thanks, True. You deserve it. <sighs> true? Hey, where'd you go? And now, for your birthday entertainment... <laughs> May I please present to you our great guest of honor! <laughs> It's True's birthday, happy birthday, True. It's True's birthday, happy birthday, True. And 